This is kind of troll for most. I'm not gonna lie. We should have broke this. I think as soon as this kill happens, we should just hit the hill. We should all just hit the hill. So like, AG should cut to his right, hit the hill. We should all just hit the hill, hit the front of the hill. We, as you can tell right here, we have a four v three on the hill. And the only reason this goes to shit is because AG gets shit timing on two. Let's just say this is like a good scenario where like dying is like better than like living, because like right here he gets the first kill. And that guy, that's the first guy that we know is ticket. And so, like, it's a two chows AG and dies. I at least have opportunity to trade him right here. But the fact that he gets this timing gets, a, gets him a free two piece. Because he just shoots me in the back and then he shoots somebody else in the back. And he also lives. Finesse from him around Boston that last game was unbelievable. The multi kills were flowing. That's all four down. No, BS Damon said the same thing. Yeah. I, mean, I don't know. I don't know what we're doing here. This is kind of troll, too. Like, here. It was multi kill. Three. We, he obviously gets a three or four piece right there, but like here we call it the rotate completely. But then, like, I go coop, rating us up three, but then AG cuts red. I think that makes all the timings awkward because, like, once again. This guy gets a kill, but like realistically, AG should be like here. So if AG's here, this guy gets this kill, then I can just run there. Makes sense? I don't know if that makes sense to y'all. But like, that's ideally how it's supposed to go. It was supposed to be either be AG trades Brandon's death right here, or he's up middle. We should be all bully on one side. It shouldn't, like, we all, like, if you just look at it, we all taking 1v1s, and we technically have the advantage on rotation here. And now I have to slow the game down because everybody else is dead. And then it makes it to where now their hold is a four-man hold because then now the guy off old is in the play. Like, say we make this play earlier. Say we kill say we kill a BZ and then we get through it. If we kill a BZ right here, a BZ spawns here. And then every every other kill we get that spawns here. Now they're all coming from here. Instead, this makes it where it's a four a four man hold. Because then now the guy of old is in the play. This gun is insane. This is bullshit. I, like, or actually, like this gun is like, so cheese. I think realistically, I mean, granted, I'm Owen fucking nine, and that's AIDS. That's AIDS. That is. I feel like. What we're doing is just like we just made the game like that first this first 100 points I got we just made the game way harder on ourselves, and like yeah I mean bro you just watch my like you just watch my era I don't even get in a gunfight the gunfight the only gunfight I get into this whole this whole sequence is this one where he jumped and fucking over the wall here and kills me, and it's just because like we're just simply running away from each other. That's just, that's just like the basic way to put it. We're just running away from each other. I'm not going to a death in every hill, but like, if you watch this, it doesn't make like I like, I don't know how to explain it, bro. How the game's supposed to play, like, bro. They're not supposed to win old and then not have us on. Like, we're not supposed to not be on the on. And we're like, we're basically, I basically went one for one the rotation, and then like here, like ants holding our fountain pens, but then nobody ever comes fountain. So then it's like. You see what I'm saying? Like Antonic found him. And they can just keep us off the hill. This is where I actually like started getting kills. But this like it, it, bro. I mean people watch the score and be like, yo, Kenny, you just started shooting better. But that like that's obviously not the case, because if you watch the winners final versus them, I was frying. And it's just funny that like my scoreboard flip flops the once the millisecond we get up we, we actually we actually win a rotation and we are actually in a holding scenario see thanks for the 12 months happy easter see now we're in control of the, now we're in control of the map like this gun bro I missed one bullet. I missed one bullet. I got four bullets on my gun, and he got five in that quick second. This is a risk game. This is something we do. We didn't practice for a minute, and like, it's not realistically like it's not a scam. It's just like, like here, Brandon sees me left, so he thinks like, oh, Ken maybe he's gonna hold the left. I guess. With him being top three, he should never jump off like this. He should just stay top there. 
he doesn't leave top three right here, then this timing doesn't happen. But then also, too, I think in this moment, it makes it A's because then now AG has a flood middle. And realistically, I guess we end up holding the time. But that could have got scary. This is also AIDS, too. See, this is AIDS as well because I'm pretty sure Ant was calling out, yo, come new, come new, come new. But, like, we were, like, me and AJ were under the, like, under the, like, idea of, like, just guarantee this time, bro. Like, we're down 20, and, like, we're down, like, maybe this is a good 20 seconds, and I'm one off the street. But then once you get kills, I'm thinking, like, oh, shit, now I can go. And then, and then I realize. Ant died, and then AG dies behind me, and then this just makes this gunfight hit, so I don't, get, I don't get my streak. Bro, chat, I can tell you right now, Brandon is not going to run a sub. There is a difference between Brandon running a sub in rank play than Brandon running a sub in a professional match. Not saying he can't do it. I'm just saying, you will never see Brandon run a sub in a professional match. We can run three subs. The issue ain't the three subs. The issue ain't three subs or two ARs. I can go back and watch the Rios and tell y'all exactly what we did. Johnny, thank you for the Twitch Prime. The Rios have nothing to do with the, like, this is the thing. As a fan and as somebody that's watching, I understand y'all probably won't understand this. But, like, how can I explain this? Gun metas will never decide if the map is a winnable map for you or a loss. Just because Shotzi or Pred has a run of AR invasion doesn't mean that, that we're going to lose the map because you're putting a, a main sub player on an AR. Has nothing to do with it. The, the, the skill like, gap in that is that can this sub player run the AR at the same speed as a sub but also take long range gunfights but not slow his pace down. That is how the game works. Scrap runs a third sub on 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 Rio, because he, his team plays the map correctly, so his sub does not matter. If Scrap ran an AR, I guarantee you, Toronto would still win the map. I can promise you, the best, I think, the, I'm pretty sure the best teams on the map, go, like, for example, LAT, Ghosty pulls, pulls out a sub. He runs the AR for most of the map, but he pulls out a sub on these smaller hills. That is just how the game works. It does not matter what gun meta you have on the map. LAT could run two ARs and play against Toronto and beat Toronto because they are better at the map. Not because they are running a different meta, gun meta, because but because they're like the way they play the map is just better. That is how it works. Our issue is that we're playing the map wrong. Not because we're running three subs or we're not running three subs or we're running two ARs and we're not running two ARs. It's the fact that, that we are playing the map incorrectly. Like P2s. I can tell you right now, like this for example. Right now, Brandon in his head is thinking, oh, there could be a sub player in this room. Now, is Brandon going to think in his head, oh, there's a sub in there. I can't go in there. No, he has to take the gunfight. It may be a hard one, and it may be at a disadvantage, but guess what? We are late on rotation, so we're at a disadvantage already. What do you do when you're in this disadvantageous spot? You got to take a gunfight that is not in your favor. What happens? He goes in. But there's nobody in here. So then now that is just free range. Now at this point, Brandon has the advantage because he can set up any gunfight that he wants. Back alley right here. That's just that that's simply how the game works. Now I think in my opinion, this is FaZe playing it wrong. So like here, realistically, what should happen here is that Brandon should stay top three and Ant should just go in this garage and look at the cross. This and wrapping the back all gives this timing to where if they make AG weak, they can just work the front side of the hill. And then, the, like, Brandon's, Brandon's kind of responsible for the front side of the hill now because of, like, Ant wrapping to the back to help AG. Uh, but then he gets flanked. But I think, like, yeah, I, I mean, the, 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 the slow, like, the slow starts are, like, terrible. Um, but I think, like, us making the maps close is speaks to how we're playing the game correctly. And I think. People will like look at this, like look at our look at the finals and say like, oh, they could have just slayed better. But I think the real issue, cause I'm like, bro, when you when you have like four talented players on the team, like there there is never gonna be an issue with them shooting their guns. They may have an off day, but then like they like how I look at it is there should be system put in place to where like even if you're having an off day, you're guaranteed to get a kill, and that's just how it should work. Like I think realistically, like. The way we played the first half of these maps, we use, we were using like little to no teamwork, and we also just like had the wrong ideas on how to break the hills. 
so I think that like everybody was just taking harder gunfights in the beginning of this map, which made it to where we started off so slow. Um, but I think that's also what leads the scoreboard to look like look as bad as it does because of the fact that like like I said before, like I was saying before, the pacing thing. Once one person throws a pace off, then the whole map becomes slower and it also just throws off a rhythm for everybody. And once at that point, once you're like feed into the the loss of rhythm, it's like uh, you just get shit timings. Like I think like even like here, like this is something that we I think we, I think we'll never do. Like we would never do in the scrim is like. Like here, I, like we're coming in a play through old, and Ant obviously ha has new, and I'm going left. But like, I think realistically, how this should how this should play out is that Ant should wrap back, and we should all just play for the back spawn. But it just makes it weird because we pull a a, a faded play. We're not even on the new hill. But then once again, that makes the timing off. Because then look at everybody. Look at look at everybody else's gunfight. I'm taking space to ta to tile coop to make sure I got going coop. Ag's back P3. So then, like, all of this space is open. Brandon even goes ticket to look front. This is what I mean by, like, timing. Everybody's timing is off. Because then now Ant goes old. And then, like, who is in, like, a, 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 a actual gunfight? Not a single person on our team. We get him all the space in the world. And this is kind of what I mean. It's like, at this point, like, when you when you put yourself in this, you have to win impossible gunfights. And I think that's, like, this is just based off, like, one, like one, one person doing something that is either not enough or too much because now everybody else's gunfight is just harder because i killed the guy that ant was going to go kill but realistically ant probably shouldn't be here what i'm saying is like realistically we get four dead on rotation if you get a four dead on rotation that should be like next kill should just be guaranteed and like realistically you like on a rotation anyways team like your team should be taking all ones and I think we put ourselves all in the 1v1s. Like, all we put, we put ourselves all in the one spot to get, like, 1v1s. But, like, let's say, like, here, like, let's say here, like, Ant kills this one guy, but then doesn't kill one. Because he doesn't kill, like, you know, you, you think, it, like, people might watch this and think, like, yo, Ant is going to dolphin out to world star this guy. No, Ant did not dolphin out to world star this guy. That's not, like, what Ant's thinking in his head. Ant is just thinking, like, I don't know where these guys are. I'm going to try to just get to red and just try to live. But then the guy just pops up on his screen. Now, the thing about that is that this guy should not be allowed to get to red without us knowing when you have four dead on a rotation. That means that all angles or all routes should be cut off. And they should have to take a gunfight to take the space that they take. But they don't take a gunfight. They kill one person, which is Brandon. And then they have, they have all the space in the world. That don't make sense. It's a bad play because if he doesn't get three, it's over. Exactly. All right, talked about this. I absolutely scammed this map. As simple as that. Unacceptable. No other way to put it. It was absolutely true. But, like, to clear the air. Uh, to clear, like, yeah. To clear the air. I, I was not challenging, like to like win them thinking that I needed to child to win the map. That is not how that worked. That is not what my that that is not the thought in my head here. The thought in my head in this moment is that three dead I'm calling out yo I have a trophy. So this whole weekend invasion control was just fucking so troll to us because of the fact that like the spawns were so weird. Like you can even tell here like here I'm like yo I have a trophy we can stack this shit. And like you can see I'm number five. I turned around to look blue. To, I look here because this is also a spawn. I'm thinking like they're gonna spawn deep. I'm trying to get the information of where they spawn. So here I jump. You can see I'm here. I'm looking towards blue. I'm like, yo, they're not spawning blue. And my teammate said they're spawning gas. So at this moment, I'm like, oh, gas. Let me turn around to look gas and like shoot them. Like I'm gonna like, I'm not gonna just sit on the point and lay down and let them run at the point because at that point like four could just pinch our side. Let's say all all three of us are looking this way. Then he just pinches our side and shoots into the back. Let's also say that I look at our pinch and then. They all fork on their side of time and shoot us all on the side. Then it's like, it's true. So, like, here, realistically, I think it's just A's that, like, my teammates get stunned with a trophy on the point. Because, like, Ant and Shotzi, I mean, AG and Shotzi are going to shoot them coming towards the point without trying to die. They're going to try to pepper them so that it slows them down for a second. If you slow them down for one second, millisecond, they, we win the map. You could say the map guarantee if we just lay on the point, but in the moment, you may not know that. So, like, um... Here, they, I throw a trophy, and then they get stunned. But, like, realistically, let's say that, like, right here, Ant can stay there side time and shoot them. Because, like, Dra they have the full sprint. Like, he kills, draws a sprint at the point, the map's over. Um, 
and that's realistically like why I end up dying. Because at this point, I didn't realize like I'm looking at a whole different point, like point of the map. And here, like I turn around like this way, and when I turn around, I didn't realize that Shotzi and Ag gave up their side. So then I go to like take the space to like shoot them pushing, and then eight, like MC's pre fire and kills me. So you can see he's just literally shooting. Um, I don't know why Brandon spawned so far, bro. I, I can't explain it. Like, don't get it twisted, bro. I'm not here to like. I'm not putting anybody on the bus. Our team played phenomenal. I'm actually. I'm. I was very happy with how we played. If anything, I was more pissed at myself because of the finals. Like that control shit is just unacceptable. I'm just trying to give you guys the insight that I would on my. Uh, listening video because we won't be doing a listening video this time. Are they the hardest team in scrims on land? Uh, we didn't scrim. I don't know if we scrim phase. We didn't really scrim phase. I don't think any of the top. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. we didn't scrim any top four teams. Chat. Yeah, I think I appreciate y'all for saying yo, you were fine, you were shooting. That's just not the case, bro. It, like you can shoot all day when you make a troll play like that. Like that could just swing the momentum of a whole series. Like once again here, like we we troll this rotation. And then like we super troll this, but then I win two gunplays I'm not supposed to. That's a bailout. Joke don't land crazy, but that's just a bailout. Like if I don't win these two gunfights, I don't even think we end up breaking this shit. We don't even like if I don't win these two gunfights, we probably don't even contest this. We're probably just getting farmed for a whole minute right here. This hill is so hard to break. But I think realistically, like if I think we have a better chance of winning this hill if I kill draws here. Like Zach just makes it like I even knew Zach was gonna be here. It's so funny because I know for a fact I wish I can get the comms right now. I was like, yo, Draw is gonna be close. I'm pretty sure he's gonna be under me. And I look like I clear it right here. He just wins the gunfight. Um But at this point, like since there's no instant trade on draws, now we have to like now we gotta figure out where the fuck draws is at. We find him, but like bro, he's a trophy. See, P2 is like P2 is like a guy like Hills to like easily just finesse and hold, but like once you're in this scenario where you just gotta flood tunnel, like it's so it's like the only way they ever win this is if like Zach wins this gunfight right here. That's the only way you ever win this. Like they ever come back and win this hill is if he wins that gunfight right there. If you tell me that's an easy gunfight, I'm uh, bro. You stop it, bro. I paid, bro. Ad block don't work, bro. I troll this. But like this is also like a miscom. Like this is just like one of those moments where like. I couldn't really like explain what the fuck I wanted to happen in my head to my teammates. I was like, yo, I have the cross, just stay down, just stay down. But what I meant was like, play off my contact, which was what I probably should have said. Like, yo, play off my contact, like chow off me because I, I can get the first kill. But I think right here, like Brandon tried to cross back to the hill because he thinks they cross into the hill, but they don't ever cross. Like if he just sits right here, P5 and just shoots with me, then we probably just mow them down. But I was that was on me because I was kind of like stay down I have the cross but I didn't that's not what I meant I meant like stay down until I die basically like shoot with me there's a few things that like I feel like people don't like take into account when they like talk about people making bad plays or good plays like comms uh like the right play obviously like what the right play is the comms and like the player I guess oh I'm gonna post the whole thing Chris I got a lot. I must have been two turn because I, I I don't think I've ever done this wall bang in scrims. I know the wall bang is I know of it obviously as I do it. I just in the moment I was just so locked that like that was like that was like some Doctor Strange like that was some Doctor Strange like possibility type. I was just like, wait, I can locate just wall bang this shit. Like, I was also scared for them to be already in the new hill. So what I was gonna do is like wall bang and then wall bang and like bait and try to like get my like look at my own push and like hopefully somebody runs at me and try to like catch me wall banging. You telling this door was insane. That's how you. That's what I'm so saying. But then like you know, cause like here like I don't make anybody weak. But when I chow the hill, I see Zach here. Like, I seen him. Um. So I was like, he's not going to expect me to chow out the door. <laughs> Motherfucker's getting caught lacking, look. But also, if I don't make this play, I'm probably dead to simp. <laughs> Slam. Slam. Uh, yeah, How does it go? Like, <laughs> gotcha, bitch. Gotcha, bitch. 
in front here at the I actually did hella damage this time too. Like I wasn't hitting it right here, but I hit him right right before they switched me. Up a point before phase battle right mm. back in. A flurry of changes inside the point now. It's Kenny trying to work this two man game, but dropping in front of look at, him. Look at look at Zach. Is that Zach? Who's in the hills? Yeah, look at Zach shitting himself. Slammed. Uh, slammed. Uh. Look at him. Slammed. Okay. Also seeing people. <laughs> two guys. Okay. Also seeing people saying like if AJ doesn't debut here, we probably win this map. That's not true. Like that's just not true at all. Teenage were crazy. Don't get it twisted. Uh, but it doesn't win us a map. Why didn't y'all rotate when you realized both y'all win on next? Well, realistically, in this moment right here, exactly, not ev nobody ever rotates the new. Because where are you going to rotate the new from? You got to run through bottom garage to new, or you got to rotate ticket. And the way to rotate is the way is a is the place they're spawning. It's kind of like a hard one. It's kind of just like a guarantee this time, and we got to set up a break for for new. But P5 is like such a hard hill to, to break. But it's like, realistically, that's like your only idea in your head, and like. Like, look at where we're spawning. Who's really going to go new? The only way you ever go new in this scenario is if Brandon right here goes new. And, like, in the moment, it's such a hard call because, like, even if he goes new by himself, that doesn't guarantee us new at this moment. I think six spawns in the garage at one point. Right here, he spawns top middle. That's top middle. Like real, that's 45 seconds. Where is Ant gonna go to hide for 45? You gotta go hide for 45 seconds. There's just no way. If you're gonna rotate 45, you're going to hell. Cause you gotta go. You gotta keep in mind if they if you don't block the spawn and you they keep spawning on you, that means you need to literally eight piece them or four piece them by yourself, or you need to buy enough time for your teammates to get to you, which is not is just not gonna happen because in like realistically you're on a four u three rotation and you're in a disadvantage. Uh, like the only time in the, to rotate maybe would be like here, but like realistically, you just gonna rotate. You're gonna take the faster route to the new hill. So like here, you're just gonna run through tunnel. You get all the kills that tunnel, you're gonna run through tunnel, and that's what Brandon tries to do, but dies. That's the only way you're gonna get to new here. <clears throat> you don't have to hide. Just flip the spawns. Uh, well, once again, let's let let's say we flip the spawns. You are still like let's say that let's let's say that. Where's Brandon? Let's say a Brandon goes new, kill cell one v one, and he's and he's right, right like he's here right on this forklift. If Faze all die here and spawn radio, you think Brandon is gonna one v four the rotation? Because at that point, we would have to kill them on this hill and all of us leave it to win the rotation. That's just like that's so that's such a hard like it's just such a hard call to call because realistically in Brandon's head it's forty seconds. You're never gonna like go for a one v four rotation. Unless you're in like a top P2, because that place is like un like it's like unkillable. And you can also buy time for your teammates. There's really no spot on the P5 hill to buy time, except for top P2. But then that also isn't the hill. It's like realistically, our best our best bet was like here. Like here, if I don't die, we have a chance. Like if I don't die to this day, we have a chance to win the map. Not because of the streak, but because of the fact that like I'm alive and we can like give him more pushes on like the rotation to try to flip it it's easy to look at on the mini map and think like oh, i could have just did that but i don't know i'm just happy we kept it close even though they were shooting nukes they're shooting nuke like that's the thing bro he's a great team all talented players they're shooting nukes but they're also like making it easy for each other Not saying we don't. I'm not saying we don't. I'm just saying that like that like they just they just have more situation where they did, um, and we did it. Simple. And that will always happen between the top four, quote unquote teams and the good teams in this game. Is that it's always gonna come down to the wire. It's gonna be like who makes less mistakes than another team. That's always gonna be the thing. <clears throat> I mean, that's good. That's what I'm saying. Like, they just made less mistakes with us. They won both P5s. We also won a P2, but then they get, we lost, like, the last few, like, the last 30 seconds of the P2. Um, and then we trolled that P3 hold and the P, and the first P4 hold where, like, 
I child, but I'm thinking like as a, like the team is childing, but that's just on me. If I didn't calm that we should child, then it's definitely on me, but who knows? It is what it is. <laughs> Like even then, you can say that like Phase trolled a lot of situations, and that's why they left, that's why the game even got close. But once again, when you troll versus a good team, they're gonna capitalize on it. So we just capitalized. That's why the game was close, as well. <clears throat> Simple as that. It's COD at the end of the day. <laughs> 